Hey there, my name is Stephanie Bernthal from ESC 17 and today we are going to go over the app Chatterpix. So in my search here, I already have it pulled up. You can see what it looks like up at the top. Um, there's a Chatterpix and there's also a Chatter Kid. Both work the same way and are essentially the same app. They just have different sharing options. Um, for Chatter Kid, you can't share to as many of the social media options, which is kind of a nice choice for some of the little ones. So I'm going to tap on the first one and just open Chatter Picks for the purpose of this video. And while it loads, I'll just briefly explain what it is. Um, Chatter Picks is a great video. You can make any image that you want talk. And you can also do audio recordings. So um, the first thing that I'm going to do is just go to my gallery. And you can see here, this is where kind of my old images have been kept, or um, maybe some of the basic images that they've used or provided for you. So I'm going to get started by tapping on the camera on the bottom of the screen. And then you can see here that you can either take a picture of what's around you, um, you can take a selfie by clicking on the reverse camera button. For me, I am actually going to just choose a picture from my camera roll. I have some copyright friendly images saved on my camera roll that I plan to use. So I'm going to tap once on that and open up my camera roll. And now I can choose any of the good copyright um, pictures that I have saved right on my device. So for today, I'm just going to go ahead and use this little piglet. And now I'm just going to tap off to get that to disappear. And so now I'm going to hit, now I have my picture ready to go. Um, I can make it bigger or smaller if I want to. For me, I want to make sure that my copyright um, licensing information is still there. So I'm going to leave it like that and hit next. Okay, and the next thing you do is you just draw a line. Um, and you can draw this line anywhere. So it kind of magnifies where you're drawing it. If you don't quite like where you're going to draw it, you can draw it lower. And what this line is, is it's going to be the part of the picture that becomes a talking mouth. So I'm going to leave it right there for now. And now that I have my line drawn, I can do a recording. So I'm going to hit the record button. Hi, my name's Wilbur the Pig. Okay, so now that I have my recording done, um, you can push the play button to hear it back if you want. Okay, and um, next I'm just going to turn my volume up because I think it's way down. Now I'm just going to hit next in the top right corner. So you can see if you want to, you can also kind of um, change the image style. If you have a certain kind of project you want it to look like, um, you know, you can put little, you know, vintage effects and things like that on it. So you can kind of pick how you like it. I'm just going to leave it on the original. Um, you can add funny things like hats and earphones and whatever you want to your little creature. I might put this cute little hat on him because that's kind of cute. And um, you can also put like a little frame around it if you would want to. And finally, you can add text. So if you wanted to say, hi, mom, or something like that, you could add text to it. But once you have your picture the way you want it, I'm just going to hit next. And your picture, your video is pretty much all the way done. So now you can choose to trash it, you can choose to play it and watch it, or you can choose to export, which is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to hit the export button. And I'm going to save it right to my photos. You can see here you can actually upload it right to YouTube or email it. But I'm just going to export it to my camera roll. Okay, and now I'm going to press my home button and go back to my photos. And I'm not sure that my um, volume is going to play or not through the connection I have with my iPad, but I'll go ahead and just show you what it looked like. I'll just push play. And there I have my little talking pig. Um, this is a great app for storytelling. It's a great app for if students are studying animals and um, you want to kind of bring their reports they write to life. The kids love it. It's a really easy thing to do. And once it's in your camera roll, you can also use it with other creativity apps. Um, feel free to contact me if you have any questions regarding this app.